I am Milton, son of a carpenter Mary. And this parable starts in a church on Sunday. Back in the good old days. They built those churches, uh, right? Built them to last. We're at the back of the church with Olga and Olaf. And uh, Olaf looks over and there on the other side of the aisle is a handsome bearded Harry son of a carpenter and Mary just surrounded by the attractive young ladies and uh He says to Olga, is that that same one, the new one? And uh, Olga says, yeah. The gray seems to be washing away. The wrinkles ironing out. And Olaf looks a little closer and says, his eyes are different. And Olga tells him, oh yes, that one. She points to one of the girls. Near the handsome stranger. She said she likes blue. So he's changing his eyes to blue. And Olaf says, you can do that? And Olga rolls her eyes and says, oh, apparently you can. Across the aisle with the handsome, hairy son of a carpenter and Mary. He is telling the young people. It is about so much more than what you see here. The book the priest reads for him up there is so watered down. Look within your soul. the eyes of your heart. You will see so much more. You will see truth. Back with Olga and Olaf. Olaf asks, where is Halsa? And Olga tells and he's She's been feeling a little sickly lately. She's at home. And yeah, at home with, uh, at her house. Halsa is coughing and wheezing and hacking and cursing in between all that, that Handsome, son of a carpenter and Mary. Later on, they'll all get together from the church, have a little meal, and Eva it says to old guys, she's uh, preparing to feed everyone. Give him 
the smallest portion. He eats too much. And then he has that appetite for all those girls. And then he either steps away and has a little bit of a call. And Olga asks, are you all right? And Eva says, oh, I'm coming down with something. Oh, yeah. The Black Plague. Also known as the Hatred Plague, the uh, Jealousy Plague, the Anger Plague. I'm Milton, son of a carpenter and Mary. Pass along my parables. Take me to spring break. Pass along plenty of copies so everyone can call that number. 424-229-4140. Make a video of your hijack calls and mail to me. And yeah, as of late, here at Vista Veranda in Linwood. You make a video of doctors. Work from St. Francis nearby and have patients here at... Uh, Linwood, all who all doctors from the Burlington Convalescent Hospital, where I spent a year and a half, not getting one. Semper Fi call, one ninety three check call, one call about my imagery, my parables, nothing. That's men and censorship in America. You make a video of your phone not working, and you ask that doctor in front of you, what do you know about this? What do you think about this? Get them on video. Being good, being bad. Being a part of the dangerous censorship, that's your lifeline. You're not being able to reach this fellow American, John Milton Brady. A phone, mail, or internet, you don't know when else that phone won't be allowed to work. Like when you need the fireman, the police, the paramedic. you got to do the job the reporters aren't doing. They're already placing someone new this 2016. March 11th, today. Remember to ask those politicians running for presidency, running for local office, ask all officials, ask all cops, give them an opportunity to weigh in on the side of the Christ complex, Jesus is out here, or on the other side of that. Get it for Simplify DVDs, flash drives, be disciples of truth. Get that truth out there. But nothing I tell you, just about that phone not working. And you not knowing when else it won't be allowed to work, by all means, call Vista Veranda. I don't hope to be here long, especially since they're not giving me pain meds. Oh yeah, those sins of mankind would. Uh, spring break must be starting. Be good. Yeah, the wounds are the same as when the pain with the wounds. The same as when I started in the hospital, Good Samaritan, June of 2014. When they give me a five cc's, whatever the amount is, a morphine. The only pain medicine is really going to work. Yes, attractive blonde girls. Near blonde as well. Come see me. We got work to do. We got the Christ complex to build. Come see me. Be a video pioneer. Get up that. Uh, get out that video camera. That phone. This is a twenty dollar phone making a nice uh, low death. I can talk for a while. Parable. Get it out. Put what you have to tell the world right here on video. Pass along at church, at work, at school, at spring break. At that military base, wherever good folks get together, around that great wall, man. Pass it along, and come see me, the one and only John Melton Brady. We got work to do. Christ complex is the bill, change, millennia, in the making to get to. I'm easy to find. Look for the guy with the DVDs on my chest. That's how I reach the world, despite the world not being able to reach me. You got the street internet, check out my YouTubes. 
youtube.com slash Melton for imagery. That's uh, one with just uh, one nice imagery on it. Check it out. You can find uh, youtube.com slash mvmmix. M-I-X-M-V-M-M-I-X, -M 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 -I, I think. Check it out. Uh, come see me in person. Of course, look for those eyes of the heart. DVDs worldwide, flash drives, and laptops at, at spring break at uh, campuses uh, across the world. And yeah, come see me when you see some a lot of impersonators out there, a lot of uh, lies about the one and only, John Milton Brady. You see someone other than me, my changing eyes, right here in my imagery, on my chest, on my wheelchair right now. Oh, things change. You see someone other than me and my change and we start building Jesus' house. Come be a part of it. You're going to see it all done right here. Just like you pick up that camera, start your own success story with videos. You're going to see it all played out right there going from your college to wherever you go from there. Whatever success you're looking for. Make that video. Start building that library. And come see John Melton Brady. I'm easy to talk to. Oh, especially if you're an attractive blonde girl. You iron out my wrinkles. So. Come see me. The son of the carpenter in May. And let's uh, get started. You call me up to tell me how, how much you don't like uh, those parables or what you think about them and whatever it is you believe. That's religious censorship. And oh, yeah, let me get that in. When you test your phone for that religious censorship, make sure when those Mormons knock, those are smiling, helpful. Look for a lot of smiling, helpful folks when you come to see John Milton Brady, to be in the way, to tell you lies about me. When those Mormons knock on your door worldwide, pick up that phone. Call 424-229-4140. Say, why can't I reach this man? I want to tell him what I believe. That's religious censorship. Get their reactions for your Semper Fi videos. Pass it on at work at church at school. And yeah, you like me, you don't like me. Come see me. I'll put you right here. 